I'm not happy about it. But again, he's not in violation of an agreement. Uh, we speak. Uh, I received a uh, very nice letter from him last week. We, uh, we speak. He was upset that uh, South Korea was doing the war games, as you call them. Uh, I don't think they were necessary either, if you want to know the truth. And I said to my people, you can have them or not. I would recommend against them, but I'm going to let you do exactly what you want to do. I said that to all of my people. I said, I don't want to interfere because I think if you want to do them, you can do them if you think it's necessary. But I think it's a total waste of money. And uh, they, uh, they did a modified version of them. John Bolton, would you say that's correct? It's a yes. very much modified very version. Uh, but I, I think it was unnecessary to do. Thank you. Any update on another meeting with North Korea? Probably have one, yeah, probably. But so I'm not, I'm not liking short range because short range is uh, Shinzo's, you know, it's really his territory. I mean, I'd like to ask Shinzo, how do you feel about North Korea and the testing of short range missiles? I'm not, not thrilled. I'm not, I'm not, but you know what? Thank you, Dan Dominic, for the so our position is very clear uh, that the uh, launch of short-range ballistic missiles by North Korea clearly violates the relevant UN Security Council resolutions. Uh, so in that sense, it was extremely regrettable for us to experience another round of the launch of the short-range ballistic missiles by North Korea in recent days. Mr. And Prime I can, Minister, I can understand how the Prime Minister of Japan feels. I mean, I can. It's, it's different. But, uh, I mean, I can understand that fully. Mr. Prime Minister, would you like President Trump to come further to your position on this? As we have done before, I would like to make sure that uh, we, meaning myself and President Trump, will always stay on the same page when it comes to uh, North Korea. And also, I'd like to underscore that I uh, fully uh, support the uh, U.S. North Korea uh, process 100%. Uh, but are you on the same page if you see these things so differently? I, mean, I think ultimately we're always on the same page. As long as he's prime minister and as long as I'm president, I think we're always on the same page. Mr. President, you don't think that the, the short-term or the short um, missile launches no, are, are a violation of UN resolution? Because I never discussed that with him personally. You're talking about personally. I never discussed that with him. I discussed long-range ballistic and that he cannot do, and he hasn't been doing it, and he hasn't been doing nuclear testing. Uh, he has done short-range much more standard missiles. A lot of people are testing those missiles, not just him. A lot of people are testing those missiles. We're in the, we're in the world of missiles, folks, whether you like it or not. I have confidence that in the end, Kim Jong-un, who I've gotten to know very well, will do the right thing. Uh, and I think in the end, he will do the right thing. We'll see. Maybe not. Maybe. But I think he'll do the right thing. See what happens. Thank you all very much. Thank you, President. Right this way. Thank you, guys.